Hello and welcome to your Southeast Idaho planning briefing for Tuesday, March 30th. My name's Alex from the National Weather Service in Pocatello. I do apologize for the crudity of the video. Due to a national network outage, we're unable to access many of the programs that we would typically use to create this briefing. And we're also unable to utilize many of the graphics that you're used to seeing for this briefing. So uh, there'll be less uh, graphics than normal and also uh, a shorter briefing overall, but we thought it was important to still get it out to you. Much quieter conditions will be in store today. Uh, quieter and colder will be about 10 to 15 degrees below average in terms of temperatures for today with cold northwest flow in place. And in that cold northwest flow, that'll promote a few snow showers, especially along the eastern highlands this afternoon and early evening. Otherwise, drying and warming conditions will commence on Wednesday and continue through Saturday. In fact, we may even experience some record or near record high temperatures on Friday and Saturday with temperatures getting well up into the 70s across the southern Snake Plain and eastern Magic Valley. Your satellite image from this morning is showing uh, right in the middle of the screen here, there's an area of high pressure that's building and that's going to build north and east over our area to close out the week. And we can see some of these weak disturbances here, like this one over eastern Oregon. That'll help promote some of the shower activity across the eastern highlands this afternoon and early evening. Any amounts, though, should be very little and generally less than an inch. And your weather impact summary bears that out. We don't have any colors on this impact matrix out through Saturday. Just highlighting the breezy conditions today and also the light snow showers over the eastern highlands. But otherwise... Uh, we don't expect any impactful weather through Saturday. Let's take a look at those gusts for this afternoon. They'll be out of the northwest over the northern half of the area. It, winds will be out of the west over the southern half of the area with the strongest winds basically from Burley south where we could see some gusts in the 25 to 35 mile per hour range this afternoon and some of these brighter green colors. But much lighter winds than we experienced yesterday, that's for sure. And as we mentioned, we'll be 10 to 15 degrees below average for today in terms of temperatures, right around average for late March and early April on Wednesday, but then we'll start to push up above average for Thursday and Friday. And we're looking at Saturday's high temperatures here, which will be the warmest day uh, over the next week. And you can see mid to upper 70s, even get up into Idaho Falls, good chance of hitting 70 degrees there as well. So again, we'll have cool breezy conditions today. A few snow showers along the eastern highlands, the Wyoming border region, but otherwise dry and gradually warming conditions through the weekend. Although our systems are down, you can still reach us at the phone number you see there on the screen, and you can still email us as well at the email address you see there. We'll be happy to provide you with some forecasting information. Have a good day. Thank you.